Montezuma, 1515 to 1521. After centuries of conquest, the Aztecs now rule the mightiest empire in Central America. But when strangers appear on the shores of the Caribbean Sea, Montezuma, Emperor of the Aztecs, is unaware whether they are conquerors or gods. Can a vast empire of warriors using obsidian spears and cotton armor hold off mounted invaded all invaders armed with metal armor and gunpowder? In this campaign, we'll be playing as the Aztecs for our first Mesoamerican civilization. Reign of Blood. Passed down to you by Cuauhtémoc, eagle warrior of Tenochtitlan, an omen appeared above the forest, the shape of an ear of corn, but blazing like daybreak. It seemed to bleed fire, drop by drop, like a wound in the sky. I am a warrior, not a priest and knew not what to make of such a sign. I consulted with the seers and magicians to see if another great war was coming. But they answered only in riddles. The gods want more sacrifice was their answer. That was always their answer. Much of our empire of rainforest and volcanoes has been conquered in the name of sacrifice. The magicians tell us that we must make a sacrifice every single day for the sun to continue to rise. It took the relay teams two full days to carry my message the 200 miles to our city of Tenochtitlan. After two more days, my uncle Montezuma, emperor of the Aztecs, sent his reply. Montezuma's priest foretold that the god Quetzalcoatl might soon return from his long exile. How else to explain the omen? Montezuma ordered my warriors to increase their efforts to consolidate the rainforest between our land and those of our enemies. We must establish control over four shrines that are sacred to Quetzalcoatl, the Feathered Serpent. Because the Aztec Empire is mighty and constantly expands, we have made many enemies. We must defend these shrines from our enemies in order to prepare for Quetzalcoatl's eventual return. Alright, our first adventure was in Mesoamerica. We need to capture the four shrines, monasteries, sacred to Quetzalcoatl. Place a sacred relic in each of the four shrines. <clears throat> Restricted to castle age and a population of only 75. You must defend the shrines that are sacred to the god. Constructing new monasteries is not sufficient to please him. The enemies will attempt to destroy the shrines in order to embarrass you before the gods. Therefore, do not attempt to claim the shrines until you can defend them. As defeat will ensure... Will ensure if one of the shrines is lost. Aztec monks are very powerful when fully upgraded. You can train them once you capture a shrine, monastery, and have advanced to the castle age. Starting off in the feudal. Montezuma in green begins in the feudal age with only a few soldiers. These must defend the Aztec town from early attacks. Our enemies are three. The Titaluku in red are located to the west. Their army of swordsmen and eagle warriors can be dealt with relatively early. The Panaka in orange dwell to the north of our town. The walls may keep us out of the town until we have siege weapons. They train archers and eagle warriors. Yeah, eagle, eagle. The Aksomadnilu? In purple, are your most dangerous enemy. They live far to the north and train archers and scorpions. Do not engage them until you have many eagle warriors or jaguar warriors at your command. To start things off, we are considered an infantry and a monk civilization. Our villagers can carry uh, three more than usual. Our military units are created 11% faster. Our monks have more health with each monastery technology. And we start off with 50 gold. Uh... I thought we also got an extra villager to start off with. Or maybe maybe something else, because I was like, oh, the 50 gold I think is usually like people go straight into getting loom with that 50 gold. A unique unit is the Jaguar Warrior. A unique text are... At Atalil? Skirmishers have plus one attack and plus one range. And if we get to the Imperial, we get Golan Wars, giving our infantry plus four to attack. A team bonus that relics generate more cash. So, we got Archer, we got Arbalester and the Elite Skirms. But we don't get Cavalry. That's going to be a uh, thing with them, because they do not make stables. Uh, but we do get the entire champion line. We only get Pikemen. We get Eagle Scouts, a fast inventory for scouting and raiding. 
Uh, these guys take forever to, uh, not spawn. They take forever to train in the feudal age, but become faster in the castle age. Uh, resist the conversion. Strong versus monks and archers, but weak versus men at arms and cavalry. So this is essentially your, essentially your knight with a little bit of a scout, considering uh, they're possibly strong against monks and archers. Then you got like the advanced eagle scouts and the elite eagle scouts. Uh, we got uh, Gibson squires, or send to all that. Siege workshop. We don't get uh, well, we get the entire battering ram, the entire mangonel. We just don't get the heavy scorpions. Uh, for our text, we get nothing for horseback, but that's fine. Uh, which means we get everything else except for the ring, ring ultra armor. As for ships, we get fast fire ships. We don't get cannon galleons. We don't get heavy demo. We don't get galleons. We only get war galleys. Uh, for the university, we don't get keep, so we can only get guard towers. We don't get bombard. Uh, we won't get the architect or this, so we won't get stronger buildings, although we can get heated shots. Uh, we can get the Eagle Warrior, an Aztec unique infantry unit. Strong versus infantry, but weak versus camel, uh, ca cavalry, and archers. So it's essentially infantry to strong against infantry. Uh, we can get monks, we can get everything in here, and considering these guys get... 5 health for each monastery technology, that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... Yeah, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. That's an extra 55 to their health. And that's probably not even uh, including this one that gives you 15. So that would be what? 70 health combined to that, so 100 HP monks. Uh, all the normal stuff in the town center. We get everything except for two man saw and guild. All right. Jay, Alright, I'll have you guys start going. We're all starting off with, uh, some Eagle Scouts. I'm gonna leave you behind. Oh, yes, instead of, um... Yes, instead of the one thing we get... Oh my god. I hear the growl of the Jaguar. Is this a bad omen? Walk. Okay, so instead of pigs, uh, we get turkeys. They're all boar around, so there is uh, animals for us to use. That's uh, another turkey. Gladly accept that. See, so right now I'm just trying to build up my population a little bit before I start getting rid of them. Funny thing is, you could also use turkeys for scouting. Same thing with uh, pigs or whatever they were, whatever they were. That's a monastery, but I can't do anything with that till the next stage. So it might not have been a good idea to have gone there so early. Okay. I'm gonna back these guys up. Oh! This is the whole thing about Jaguars. Okay, guys, get back to walk. Okay, you can go back out and explore. Uh, yeah, I don't have food. I want to drop that off and then start shopping. And we can also get the trees there as well. Yeah, that's a gate. You were talking about. I'm gonna send them up that way. Thank you. Oh no, I got a turkey right here. Okay. Comanche. 
Okay, let's just wall them off real quick. If I don't have to worry about them too much, you can go down that way, you over here, go over that way. Keep forgetting to do about these guys. Oh, sh- Bring these guys in real quick. Alright, can you go out there and deal, deal with that? Uh, actually, you can go over this way and start dealing with that. Okay, I got. Oh my God, I'm getting myself all thrown off. You guys come out here. Probably go block that off. I probably want to get those boar soon enough. Okay, you guys can relax. Although I've hit my population cap. Okay, I got housed. Uh, I'm gonna have to also get to the next stage. That's something else I didn't even think about here right now. Okay, that's done. Perfect. Go that way. Alright. Oh. I need one of you. We're gonna come out here and lure in this boy. He might be a little bit too far. Actually, you can get this one first. He's a lot closer. Ooh. What I'm hearing. Ooh. Here we're going. I should have scared us into you. Get to walk. Okay, you can go over this way and lure him. I should have did real very well when I wasn't doing anything. You can stay inside the town center for right now. Get the boar. Okay, I'm gonna say, I think it takes two shots to make sure that the creature stays locked on to you. Otherwise, uh, it could potentially run away. Not run away, but, like, lose aggro. Ah, oh, like that. Oh, come on. Dang it. Got too far away. That's cool. No, the boat's too fast. Dang it. Are you serious? There we go. Okay. Why don't you guys go over this way? Build me... Build me that mill. Oh. 
Oh yeah, we'll be able to help, help out a little bit. You can come over here and get this guy. Okay. I think about we'll be able to be able to move faster with this. So I can aggro two of them. That would be fantastic. But you're definitely not getting back fast in time. They're gonna be uh, looking for something to do. Okay, let's see if that works out. Okay, they're still chasing, that's good. It is taking a bit of a beating. Okay, perfect. Alright, meet back on the menu, boys. Okay, let's get a blacksmith after you drop that off. Yeah, get this and that. Oh no, that's a terrible place for that. That's just gonna get in the way of my food ego. But <laughs> I forgot these guys can carry three more. So 23? No, how much can you carry? But Got 31. Okay, yeah, these guys can carry a freaking ton. All right, you can come over here and grab this as a ball. Let's say, what are you guys doing? Come on. Any more ball about? Not that I saw. All right. Uh, I still need more food. I need more gold. Okay, beautiful. You can just go start mining that. I can also start selling. That works out. I just need the food now to keep everything going. How much do you have? You have 340. Okay. There we go. You guys can just go back to that. You can get on that. Uh, do I buy? Buy it. We'll regret it later. Age, we can get some more stuff. I can get myself two more town centers. What do I want to do with those? I don't know. I can get myself monks. Seems like I might not have to worry about the enemy. They haven't attacked me, which is surprising. Oh, maybe because they're waiting to get to Castle Age. I didn't realize that one. Uh, you're 200 and 200. Not spending a lot of gold. All right, let's get you guys down. All right, you guys can go after that. What do I got? I got 10 there, and I got 16 here. So, uh, yeah, I could use a bit more. Oh, yeah, also double bit axe.
Ah, fish. I'm sure I got right there. That is 12. I have 10. Well, I just need two more then. I'll be fine. Uh, I'll grab you. I'm thinking these guys. Oh, you guys drop that off. No. Build me a town. Shoot. Build me a town center there. Not perfect, but it will be fine. You can get me a monk. Outside. 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 Just get to walk. Oh, right. You're not doing anything. That's stupid of me. Uh, I need more cash for that. Oop. Okay. Got a monk. Perfect. Got a relic. Uh, how about we get some stone? We can use that for protecting my relics. Or my, uh, monasteries. Grab that one as well. But nay. Outside. 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 J. E. Hawk. Outside. Comanche. Uh oh. Oh, my monk died. Uh, I still not got that upgrade yet because they don't have the cash. Right, it took a hundred gold to get the one thing. Yeah, it's Eagle Scouts on Eagle Scouts. Ah, this would be the Mayans. That's not what I was expecting. Left that alone. Uh, I definitely want my gold. Honestly, I just put a castle right here. They won't get to me. They'll be fine with. Uh, that might be a bit of a waste, but let's get the faster gold. Oh yeah, no, because we got more gold up that way as well. Walk. Okay. I do you want to drop that off. So you guys just to wall that off. Oh shoot. He's just an Eagle Scout. Come on. Thank you. Oh no, I'm strong against archers. What am I doing? Oh, you guys are just gonna be really annoying now, aren't you? Alright, well, it's my own fault. Also, I don't know why this one's going. Hey, this is not going. This is not a great start for me. <laughs> I mean, it was a great start. It was a fine start. It's just uh, a bad middle. Jay? 